Well, first of all, congratulations on 1883. I'm loving this mother-daughter duo. How great has it been? Look at the way you guys look at each other. How great has it been to work so closely together on this project? It's been hard work. It's been mm -hmm. fun. I mean, we've done things, well, I think I can definitely speak for myself, but probably Isabel as well. And mm -hmm. she's capable of speaking herself. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, we've done things that I that we've never imagined doing and done before. We've had a good time. It's been hard work. Yeah. yeah. And it shows. It's been hard work. But doing it with you, my goodness. She's Aww. one of a kind. Aww. She's the loveliest person I've ever met. I love her. Mm, to so call much. her your TV mom, that's pretty cool. Isn't <laughs> it? I'm, the, I'm as lucky as, yeah, I'm very lucky. Oh, very lucky that's sweet. There were two journeys. One was filled with danger and death and despair. The other, adventure and wonder. I was on the latter. And you get to share the screen a lot with her husband, Tim McGraw, as well. Now, going yes. into this project, were you a big Tim and Faith fan? Nope, she didn't know any of our songs. Stop it. She still hasn't heard a dead dumb one. I know, but no, I'm, like, I'm, actively, I'm actively not listening to any of their music just because I, they're, yeah, they're Tim and Faith. They're, they're Tim yeah. and Faith, mom and dad Tim and Faith. They're yeah. not Tim and Faith, you know, sing, beautiful, incredible singer mm -hmm. Tim and Faith. That, well, that made sense, right? <laughs> Total sense. Well, Tim just announced a tour, so you're going to have to go check that out next for year. For sure, for sure. <laughs> Is there music on this set? I know you guys are busy, obviously, filming, mm -hmm. but in the downtime that you have, do you guys do any music, or? I mean, bleh. Build out a tune every once in a while. <laughs> <laughs> There's, I think everyone has their music playing in their ear pods mm -hmm. or something, yeah. but it, it, off, you know, on, well, on set, no. Okay. Really, they're really, I mean, I can only, I don't think so. Okay. No. So no campfire sessions. Have you? No. No, I haven't heard any music. Yeah. 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 It's, uh, yeah. I don't yes. think we're having. We're having. F we're enjoying ourselves, yeah. but we're not necessarily having that fun kind of, in that yeah, kind yeah. of way. You James Dutton? Yes, sir. Mind if we speak? Whatever you're selling, I ain't buying. Daddy! My family's meeting me here tonight, and we're heading north. And we'll keep heading north till I find country's worth the journey. Now, Faith, you have the best gig in the world being able to share the screen with your husband. How mm -hmm. special has this experience been for you guys to be able to do it together? It's been amazing, mm -hmm. honestly. I mean, Isabel and Tim mm -hmm. really have an incredible story that floats through the, uh, this show. Um, it's remarkable, the relationship they have mm -hmm. uh, as father and, and daughter. Yeah, we've never worked together in this way mm -hmm. as so we've made it a point to, to not work together when we're offset. Okay. And I will say this, when it first came in, um, we were excited, one, two, three, four came quickly and then they started trickling in and we're like, mm -hmm. we want more, we want, I would read one episode, then he would read an episode. Okay. So we made, made that kind of a, a thing between us, but we don't really mm. work scenes outside of the set. How much of Tim and Faith as husband and wife do mm. we see in James and Margaret, or do you try to keep that separate? Well, I think some things are just natural because mm -hmm. we are husband and wife, and there's some things you just, mm -hmm. it is what it is. Um, but what is beautiful is to, is to watch uh, the relationship that, that Isabel, mm -hmm. or I'm going to say, yeah, Isabel, <laughs> I won't say Elsa, yeah. is Isabel's. Isabel's character, the relationship that they have together, and uh, it's it's kind of remarkable because mm -hmm. the writing for Isabel's character is just one of the yeah. best things I've ever. Honestly, the script is one of the best things I've ever read. But her character is just the strength. The mm -hmm. it's powerful. I mean, she is a a force to be reckoned with, and as a mother of three daughters, and I consider her my fourth child, Aww. because that's how I feel about her. <laughs> <Aww>. <laughs> um, but to, to witness, well, to first read a, a story like this, but then to witness Isabel working these scenes and, and bringing this character to life is, is remarkable, because she, it, it, she's it's heroic, and, and the writing for uh, a woman in general, but a young woman especially, uh, for her age is just like, wow. Mm -hmm. It's kind of, it's extraordinary. So to see Tim and, and Isabel work 
together. They do a lot of stuff together. And the girl writes like crazy. I'm like, whoa, slow down. <laughs> but she's just going after it. Yeah. Isabel, to hear that, you're also a part of the family now. Mm -hmm. To hear all that, what does that mean to you? Well, it means the world, but um, I don't know. It, makes, it almost makes me want to, it makes me very emotional. Yeah. Um, because I, I love them dearly. And I do, I do feel like, I don't know, almost like their family now. And just being able to be a part of it, do this with them, mm -hmm. it's a dream come true. Sometimes I pinch myself in the morning just to know it's all real. They have such beautiful souls mm -hmm. and they've taken such good care of me and looked out for me like mm -hmm. they are my parents. Yeah, it's, it's a dream come true. Aww. I can't believe I get to do it with them. <laughs> I really can't, but not, just who they are. Right. They are the most mm -hmm. authentic, kind individuals I've ever met. Some wow. of the most authentic, kind individuals I've ever met. You're gonna make me cry. There's a lot of them on the set too. There's a lot of great we, we Yeah, we Everyone. have really oh my been God. blessed to, uh, to, for it to be such a grueling and hard. Mm -hmm. and, and we were warned, all of us were warned, this is not going to be a walk in the oh, park. Yeah. This is a different kind of yeah. filming. And, and But I, I think because of uh, everyone's commitment and just uh, the people are just fantastic. Honestly, great people. And we've had a, we've yeah. had a good time. When we're not working... We've had a good time. This one right here has been working her little tail off. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, my God, she's just Aww, about just in everything, uh, every scene, and um, it's remarkable to, to watch, yeah. Well, you guys hit the jackpot with the cast. Taylor Sheridan knows some good ones when he sees mm -hmm. them. Last question for you, Isabel. Obviously, your character, she gives me some anxiety sometimes mm -hmm. because I love this this freshness to her, this, this desire to experience life. We were poor. We weren't desperate. The road west is filled with failures. Failure isn't what drove him. It was a dream. And the dream is coming true. Even if that means disobeying her parents a little bit, were you like that in your teenage years too? Absolutely not. I was, the, <laughs> I was a very good child. I mean, I'm saying that. Now, I don't know how my parents actually feel about that. <laughs> Maybe a little. No, I um. I liked reading books and spending time with myself and okay. not participating and, you know, I was yeah. not a rebel, but I don't think she's a rebel either. Yeah. I think mm -hmm. she just is uh, gravitated towards mm -hmm. new experiences and can't help herself. Yeah, it's that refreshing zest for it's life. Just, everything is so stimulating right. and exciting and she just wants to grab yeah. at it and yeah. experience everything to the fullest, so. It's all good intention. Exactly, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, yeah. yes, yeah. yes. And you, do you have to go into mama mode? Do you have to channel your inner mom in those disciplinary scenes with Elsa? Uh, I mean, for sure, you know, but there are different circumstances. But yes, I think once a mom, always a mom, despite mm -hmm. where you are, what you're doing. There's just been a remarkable way of witnessing and, and reminding ourselves of the freedom of nature and what it, it does mm -hmm. for your soul. So, uh, try to be careful to realize that at, as um, a beautiful young woman, my daughter, our daughter, I mean, I know her capabilities, you know, she's very capable on horse, on yeah. everything, and um, very intelligent and spirited, uh, curious. But when you have that kind of space to free your, mm -hmm. all of the inhibitions, everything, mm -hmm. all the, I mean, the, there's just nothing greater than freedom, especially in wide open space like we have been. Whether it be freezing cold, <laughs> windy, or burning hot, <laughs> either one. But that's the unique thing about this yeah. project is we're, we're quite literally experiencing everything that they would have, but at the end of the day, we get to leave it right. and put on a warm coat mm -hmm. or, yeah. <laughs> you know. Um, we do. And, uh, and it's been really kind of insightful j just to experience that. <laughs> it has been because you think you read a lot about, and this girl here is, I mean, she reads so much, so many things. Uh, you read a lot of stories about, <laughs> about the women yeah. back in the day. Yeah, but I tell you, we have definitely, you do what you have to do when you have to do it, and yeah. because it is on set, it, it is real, and yeah. and that's the truth. And, and that's made it, I think, easier, and then also 
it, it needs to be hard in order for us to, to do a show like this. It does not need to be a walk in the park.